Um, now, I went ahead and I recreated the... <laughs> I, I took apart the wreath I did last night, again. And I added ribbon on the side, a ribbon in the middle under the sign, and a ribbon at the bottom. Can you all see that okay? I think you can. So, what happened was I posted a picture on my personal Facebook page last night. And it's it sold. So, I thought a perfect opportunity to use the other sign and show you what ribbons work well with this because the ribbons that worked good with this sign are okay but they don't the green I can put it in I can mix it in but this actually it's a, it's a different landscape of uh, colors so we're going to go with this one today I'm just making sure I said hi to everybody I think Thank you, Esther. I appreciate that because yet again, we've gotten another list of words we cannot say. So I will just say I posted a link. I think that's one of the words I'm not allowed to sell. Nope. That is a word I can share. I posted a link to my Etsy boutique since I can't share the other words. Thank you, Beth. I love this sign. I, I absolutely fell in love with the angel. Primitive is the way I decorate my house. And I want to add some more primitive signs to my, um, my Etsy boutique. So, um, yeah, I thought it'd just be kind of neat. And then I went ahead and I made little hearts. Because as you know, in this one, we had stars. Because this sign actually has stars all throughout the border burgundy stars and this one has hearts so i thought okay let's just do one with hearts so hence why i was watching missy's um my sunshine reese she had a live today and it was so awesome because she got on and she just said hello to everybody and wanted to know more about us shared a lot about herself um I know, I was shocked. Um, and that's just awesome because you guys know how, how nervous I am about putting my wreaths on my shop. Wreaths, that word, my Etsy boutique. Um, yeah, <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm going to have myself in Facebook jail before you know it. So, you know the routine. I do have another... Um, place that you can find me it's YouTube so if you can't find me here on a Tuesday night or a Wednesday afternoon you know that's where I'll be <laughs> I think I can share it ah, said another word I'm not allowed to use so I, I just don't understand why I wish they would explain but, hey, you know I'm going to end up there sooner or later. Because <laughs> I get to talking and not paying attention, and boom, they grab me. So, so what I'm using is my tinsel ties, which are now in my Etsy boutique. I don't think I have the green there, but I know I have the beige and the white. I tried to go with neutral colors. So we're just attaching this sign to the base. And I have to show you. When I get these swags, this is the way you get them. <laughs> Fold it in half. So you have to pretty much open the whole thing up. So just a tip, because Last night, it almost looked like it was just totally laying flat. What I did was, when I opened this one up, I took the branches down and then just perked them up on the sides a little bit. Um, it just gives you more flexibility on where you can place things so it doesn't look like you mashed it all down. I probably should have 
opened it on my live, but, you know, I'm trying to get caught up on a lot of things. I don't have my grandson this week, so we're really trying to get caught up. Beth, I got that from Sims Pottery, so if you have um, a, a, what's it called, a license, a resale license, you can order from there. If not, um, let me know. That may be something I could put in my Etsy boutique. Trying not to say that word. Really, I don't think there's a whole lot of words I can use now. All right. So we've kind of got that in the middle. I'm going to actually do pretty much the same as I did with this one last night after I turned it off. So you can see how I did it. Um, Cause I thought, geez, I should have kept the camera rolling, but I didn't. So what I've actually done is I've cut two pieces of ribbon here. I'm going to go with this ribbon, this brown, and this has like a, a taupe on it. So this actually is probably about 40 inches long. All right. So I'm going to put that up here and I'm going to attach it. I'm going to use the pine wreath as kind of like tinsel ties. And then I'm just going to loop it and twist one of these. Oh, good. Yeah, they have some awesome deals on there. The only thing for me what's really hard is shipping. Because I'm all the way up here in the northeast, so... I'm just trying to follow if I'm answering, make sure I'm answering all your questions. So I'm actually doing like a, a tie here, one here, one here, and then I'm going to do another one down here. All right. And the one down here, I'm going to actually jet this off to the side, but I am going to dovetail it. So there, you can see it one side already. Because see, the bow is going to disguise this up here. It's going to actually look like it's part of the bow when it's not. So again, we're going to do the same on this side. Can you guys see okay? Do I need to like change the... Maybe I'll bring it down a little and tell me if that helps some. See, I'm just using the pine here as my ties. I even thought about putting mesh in here. I have a black with a like a taupe in it that would look nice, but I kind of didn't want to. It's not that I want to. I don't want to weigh it down with color. Like I want to just keep it simple. So, oh, good. I'm glad. I'm kind of trying to make it even on both sides. And like I said, this was about 40, 42 inches, somewhere in that range. I just liked it better. I mean, if you were watching last night, I took some of the fabric from the balls and I just tied it in different places. And it just, it just didn't look right to me when I was done. So... I think what we'll do next, we'll go ahead and we'll work on the bow. Actually, um, my sales have gone up, Esther, um, for the signs. A lot of people, when, when some of the places were down and not selling, um, they were able to purchase from me because I had the ribbon to match the sign. Cor 
co yeah, coordinate with the sign is what I mean to say. And I do like this. Now this one, for some reason, isn't exactly like the one that I had last night. The last night it had plastic in it too, besides the two different kinds of pine. So I don't know why this one doesn't, but I'm okay with that. All right, we're gonna put this aside and we're gonna go to our bow. Because then we'll see where it covers and what we need to fill in and so on and so forth. So what I've decided to use, I'm going to use the maroon because I'm going to pull the, well, burgundy. I'm going to pull the color out of the hearts and the little berries in there. And then I'm going to use this because this actually matches the dots. And then I'm going to put a little bit of this in there too. Because it has the, what's the word I want to call that? Like linen color. And it has the burgundy and it has the green. And we don't have as much, we don't have any green in the sign, but we've got green in our pine. So, and then we'll pull this color in too. So I think I'll start with this color. And I'm going to do about a 12 inch um, tail. I'll turn it that way. Sorry, that was kind of screechy, wasn't it? Then after I get my bows on, because we're going to actually add a couple of bows, that way we'll know how much filler we have to use. And I only decided to do this so you could see the other other color scheme, because there's two different angel signs in my Etsy boutique. Oh, thank you, Beth. I wanted to go with something different. I have an order coming in that is nothing but like primitive um, ribbon. Oh my gosh. Awesome. I'm trying to get a blue and black check. I want a blue and black check to go with my L sign. And I'm having trouble finding that. So, so I wanted to do four loops on this, not two. So we're going to add two more. I'm just going to add a whole nother section on this. I know, right? And wouldn't that would look awesome with the blue and black? Oh, I think that would be just amazing. So there, I'm gonna do it this way. So I've got tails going up and I've got tails coming down. I love my Bodabra. From my willy. <laughs> Her and Steve got. <laughs> felt bad for me because I was using that broken one for so long. And it wasn't that I couldn't go out and get one. I just didn't. <laughs> I didn't make time to go out and get one. But they felt bad for me. I thought it was just so sweet. I think I'm going to do four and two. Hi, Elaine. Hey, Z. Z's on from Bulgaria. That's my girl. All right. So we've got four and two. What's the temp over there, Z? Hot or cold? All right, now we're gonna go for, we're gonna put this next. You see how that, that brings out the colors? And for this one, we're gonna do, it's probably, 
about a five inch loop and we're going to do four And then we're going to top it off with just one of this because we've got it going down the side so we don't want to overdo it plus we're going to add it in down below so we're just doing that little loop yeah that looks like what i want all right let's get our zip tie And we need some more of our tinsel tie. And those of you that watch me all the time, you know I use this on my wreath bases. Hey, Susan. Welcome. Yay. I know, right? Isn't that pretty? It just, it just... It goes so nice with the sign, and like I said, my uh, the angel one I made last night, I changed it up and put a picture on, and it sold. So I thought, wow, this is a great opportunity to show you how to do the other one, because they have different color schemes, and what worked on one is not going to work on the other. So, let's un let's do this up. Got a little mashed, so we got to lift it up some. I did a four and a two, a four and a two, four, two, four, and one. I know. I just love these colors together. And then I have that one in the middle, which, where'd it go? There it is. Now I'm using that this way to kind of cover up. And I showed you how I cover up my zip tie with my ribbons. I fold them in three, take the wire out and then um, tie it tight. Oops, there we go, that's better. Now oh, that's too big, too long. I hate that when you have one too long and you can't find, let's pull this way. Okay, now I know where it's at, there we go. Oh, that's the wrong way. Where's the other part of that? Maybe it's over here. There we go. Had to find it. Yeah, it's just a different um, color scheme. All right, let's pull this down this way. Let's pull this one down this way. I'll pull this up here. The wrong way. Boy, this ribbon looks the same on both sides. All right, let's attach it and then we'll mess with it some more. All right, so we've got it started. We added this down the side, which is what I did with that one last night after my live was over. So, and the tinsel ties are green, so they really blend 
well with the pine wreath. Hi, Peggy. How are you? Welcome. I thought Levon would be on, but then again, she said she had a meeting, so maybe that's why. And the only reason I'm putting this on is so we know where we have excess space that we have to fill in. Where's the other one? Okay. It's got to come over here. There. Now we're cooking. That's a word I can use. They're censoring us again on what we can and can't say. So I gotta be really careful. But if you didn't, you know, go in and find me on YouTube, please do. Because it's so hard not to say certain words. And I will probably get. Anybody got bail money? <laughs> if I end up there. <laughs> I don't want to go there, but I may end up there. These are words we say all the time, for gosh sakes. All right, so we've got our bow up there. All right, now let me just pull this up. For those that just came on, okay, the one I did last night, I took all the rag bows off and I changed it up. And we're kind of doing the same with this one because of the fact that... Um, if that one sold, I'm sure this one will too. So I kind of want to, I put different things in here. I made these little hearts today and we're going to put these in here. Um, and I have rusty bells and I have more of that, of those pit berries. But this has hearts on it where the other sign had um, stars. So we're just going a little bit different with this one. All right, so what I did next was I actually and you know what maybe we can change it up because this has the beige in it let's change it up I'm going to take this as soon as I find my scissors and where I pinched hey there's Missy you're not late Thank you for passing that. <laughs> I told her, Missy, I may end up in Facebook jail because I've said half the words we're not allowed to. And I said, could you guys come bail me out? Peggy said she's going to pass the hat. <laughs> so I'm going to put this here. Okay. Doesn't that look pretty? Oh my gosh. I can still say the word pretty. <laughs> And if I wasn't allowed, I would. I don't know. What do you think? You think that looks good with the green, a pop of the green there? Or do you think it looks better with this? I think it kind of makes it pop, adding that other color in. I know. Susan and I both enjoyed Missy's chat today. It was awesome. Oh, good, <laughs> because, oops, there goes the phone again. Thank you. So everywhere I pinched it, I'm putting one of these. Even though the green isn't in the sign, the burgundy is, and, the, and that linen color that's on the rest of the ribbon is. So we're just going to spice it up there maybe you should make that a weekly thing missy i think everybody got a lot out of that we love having you in our lives that was just awesome little smaller I just love these color combinations and how long have I been wreathing and it's just this year that I got burgundy ribbon 
Oops. There we go. Sorry about that, ladies. <laughs> ah! I told him the link to my Etsy boutique <laughs> is in the comments. It should be showing up now. There you go. A little bit of a delay after it fell off the wall. All right, so we're going to add, one, let's see, this one, we're not going to add one to. We're actually going to take it in a little bit further. We're going to take it in the middle closer because we're going to put a smaller bow right here. Oh my gosh, guys, I'm so sorry. It'll show up in a minute. It'll show up in a minute. It's quite the delay. That's the way I want it. <laughs> Take this off of here. But I'm actually doing it just like I did it after I turned the camera off last night. So that way you could see what I did. And because this angel is a different color palette, I thought this would just be... And you know what? I'm thinking it might not be a bad idea to take this and use this for the simple bow down here. I think the contrast is really pretty. All right, so what I did down here was I put like a five loop bow. I'm just using the wreath base as my tinsel ties. Let's turn it that way. I know, right? Gotta mess with everything. Okay, and then what I did, I cut this off here. So I told you about 40 inches, but really it's only about 36. There. Then, let's see. And I'm going to put one of my hearts down here that I made. So, underneath that, I did two loops, and then a smaller loop, and then a tail. Okay. And then that's going to go right here. Let's twist this around some. Because it's going to look like this. Pull this a little tighter because I don't want it real big. I just kind of want it to fill in that area. So what I've done is I've taken the two loops brought them out to the side and made that small center loop. Okay, this is the way I did it last night after my live. 
Okay, so you've got your bigger bow up here. These brought down to two smaller bows here, a five loop bow here, and a two loop bow here. Okay, so now we're gonna fill in. Now I even have little rusty, rusty angels, but they look like ghosts. So may, I'm not gonna use them. They, they remind me of a ghost now. But I have bells that I thought I could add in here. And I have little hearts. And I think I want to put this whole little clump of pit berries right here with one of my handmade hearts over top of it. Okay. So let's see how we're going to attach this. Because this is pretty sturdy here. Thank you, Missy. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a little touch of glue on here and adhere it to the tinsel tie. That's what's nice about tinsel ties. These little, I'll say, um, needles, they kind of really grab to stuff. You just have to hold it for a minute Cindy, long time no see, girl. We made, I'll show you, we made this one last night and it sold already. So we're using the other angel sign that is in my Etsy boutique, since I can't say S-H-O-P. New rule on Facebook. That's right. They said if I end up in Facebook jail, they're gonna they're gonna pass around the cup for me. <laughs> so I kind of want this to kind of be all country here. There we go. And then I'm gonna put my heart right in there. Actually. Just trying to see which one looks better pattern-wise. So got a lot of pattern going on down here. I kind of like this one better. All right, so we're going to put that one in there. Going to go back to our tinsel tie. Hi, Janet. Welcome. I'll send it to you, Zornitza. It's uh, stuff we can and can't say now on our lives. Now that's a word I could probably say. Primitive, primitive, primitive. <laughs> I'm just going to hold that down a minute. And like I said, it tinsel tie is really easy to um, attach to anything because the little, little like arms or legs or needles on it really, really grab quick. All right. This in here. Actually, wait a minute. Let me look here. You know what? I don't think I'm going to use the hearts. I think I'm going to go with the uh, the bells, the bells, and some of the pit berries. This is nice but i'm not liking it with the uh, ribbon now yes i don't know but there's a lot of words we can't say now i can't even <laughs> i can say go to the bargain bin basement of my etsy boutique that's my way of getting around that one. I think I'm going to use this to tie that to there. Yay! 
yep, there's, there's a lot. It's like, why? You know? I like this better. Tie this a little tighter. <laughs> yep. Actually, I want a deeper. tie it in another knot and I'm just going to tuck that down in. And then this is just going to cover over it. There we go. I like this better. And I can stick some little berries in here left over from last night for a little color. Pull that burgundy color down. From the top. Yes. We've gone country, girls. I can say that. Now, let me see. All right. Maybe we will just do some little sprays of this around with a little bit of this. Um, in Lori's group, Peggy, she sent us a list of what we can and can't substitutions for what we uh, have to substitute. So I don't know where she got it. But yeah. It's just ridiculous. Just kind of checking to see where I want this to go. I think I like that that way. Now, what I'm going to do, I'm going to go back to my tinsel ties. They better not tell me I can't, can't say that anymore. I go insane. Alright, a little glue here. Try not to burn ourselves. There we go. Look how well that blends in. The tinsel ties. Hit a rebellion stage in my life. Because <laughs> I'm allowed. <laughs> but you know what? I put it under here, Missy, and I, I gotta fold it in half because I can't read it. I can't even talk about my YouTube thing that I have going once I hit to a thousand. So I got to figure out how I'm going to get around that. 
because I, you know I'm still going to do that five sign thing when I hit a, a thousand on my YouTube channel. I can't even say that. I think it needs a little more. Let's, I'm just anticipating my next move here. It's like I'm playing chess. Because I, you know how it looks better in threes. I can say threes. <laughs> oh. Let's do that. And I want a little more berries. Berries is a word I'm still using. It's all tangled in the, the mess from the um, scrap that I used. There. I'm liking that. Kind of pull that down. Yeah, baby. I can say baby. <laughs> Sorry, guys. It's, I'm not getting much sleep. Can you tell? Like, everything's getting kind of crazy. All right. I'm liking that. So... I think next we'll kind of work on just a little bit here. Let me see. Let me just play around with this a little bit. Yeah. One, two, three. It's kind of a triangle. We're good. And then I think we can we can add some little bows. Or not bows. I can say bell and I said it. Missy, help! <laughs> Peggy's going to pass around the cup. So when I get put in Facebook jail, you guys can bail me out. <laughs> right, Peg? Peggy's taking care of me. All right, let's see. We'll get out some more tinsel ties. Thank you, Peg. Because that's a word I can't say. But I need your email to be put in the running. How do I get around that? Because <laughs> I can't say C-O-N-T-E-S-T. Gosh, what the heck? Nothing's going to stop me from giving up. <laughs> I need a button, a sensor button that I can push to drown out what I'm not supposed to say. So when I say it, I can just hit it and it'll go bleh. There, look. I covered that all up with the tinsel tie. So you can't even see it. <laughs> I can't say it. Let me see. Ooh. Let me see. Ooh, ooh, ooh. All right. What I'm going to do. I'm going to trim off some of the tinsel tie. And when I trim off the tinsel tie, I will then be able to thread my bell on there to make it part of this little embellishment. Look at that. Woohoo! I can say that. Look at that. Peggy got it. Okay. If you want to be part of the blessing celebration, <laughs> you have to private message me your um, email address to be in the running for 
five, not one, five signs. <laughs> Peggy, can you be on again next Tuesday at 7 Eastern Standard Time? Because <laughs> you're going to have to talk for me. Make my little, um, my little sentences. <laughs> and let's see, when does Missy go on? Because she's going to need help too. We both flunked today, didn't we, miss? <laughs> That's funny. I like your substitutions better than the ones we got in the thing. Because they don't work for me. Like, um, grab it now, get it now. Lowest I've seen. Great gift idea. That that doesn't work for me. <laughs> um, what's the other substitution? Save it for later. None of this makes any sense. You guys are going to think I'm off my rocker. Right? Ugh. Tomorrow at 3. Okay, Peggy, <laughs> Missy's on tomorrow at 3. we got to help her out. <laughs> we need just some bells. Let's, let's bell this baby up, because that's one thing I can say. <laughs> right through. Woohoo! I can say one ringy dingy, two ringy dingies. That's not against the law. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm being disrespectful. <laughs> I don't care. Oh. I want to bail this baby out. So let's see. Let's glue a bell in with the in with the ribbon here. There, in the middle here. So then we've got five small bells and one big bell. I'm liking that. You liking that? <laughs> there you go. Okay, send me your email. So, I don't know. Are we allowed to say look? I don't think we're allowed to say look. Ay, ay, ay. That looks pretty. Oh, I'm loving this. I think I need some of this over here, though. So, I'm going to kind of twist this around to go both ways. Everything always has to look even to me. I don't know why. And that's probably not the best way to do it. But, we got some there. So, we'll put some here. Then we got... No. I'll have to look at it in a minute. I'm missing a bell. <gasps> there it is. Hi, Jeanette. How are you? We're having some fun. We're thinking of different phrases. Ones we're allowed to say. Jeanette's going to pass around the, the cup for my bail money as I get locked up with um, Facebook. I'm just looking here. Let me just kind of see what we can do. I 
I will be having a celebration once I hit a thousand on my YouTube channel. And if you want to be part of that celebration, you're going to have to um, subscribe. Is that a word I can use? To my YouTube channel, send me an email that you subscribed to be put on the list for the celebration for the possible accumulation of five signs to one person. Only one person gets chosen. How did I do, Peggy? Was that good? Oh, good job. Because we're blowing them all today. <laughs> Both Missy and I. <laughs> we blew them. We done blew them. I'm thinking I like that. Like, do 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 do, and then one, two. Does that make sense? Do 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 do. That's a word I can say. <laughs> She's doing good, isn't she, miss? I like that there. All right, we're going to make our little grouping with our tinsel tie. I even got Lori using tinsel ties now. We were on our craftastic group the other day and she's using tinsel ties. She's like, they work so much better than pipe cleaners. It's like, yeah. See that? Covers it right up. And I even have a little room if I wanna add another bell. Which I can. And I will. I'm going to trim off those little hairy, that hairy arm there. Ouch. Yeah, Missy did awesome today. We just had a talk. We just talked. Oh, I'm loving this. Wouldn't that be awesome if I posted this one and this one sold as fast as the other one did? I'd be thrilled. Uh-oh. I'm looking. I think S-O-L-D is a word. No. No, it's not. What? The other S words are S A L E S E E L S E L L F O R S A L E <laughs> Yeah, I have bells on my door, believe it or not. Because uh, because my um my S H O P dog food S H O P is in my off the, my house, um, I actually have bells on there because people come in and I don't hear them. See, I, I didn't like the hearts. If they were a solid color, they would have looked much better. So, I think we're done, everybody. So, that's basically what I did to the other one after the live last night. So... Uh-oh, I didn't do the shake test. Where did that bow come out? Or that one came out of there. Now where'd it go? There we go. Gotta glue that in there. We don't want anything popping out. I can say pop. Woo 
hoo. I am loving this one. What y'all think? Am I allowed to say that? <laughs> I guess I can I can ask you what your thoughts are. And if your thoughts are positive, you can hit a heart. <laughs> Uh-oh, Peggy, I already forgot about what I'm supposed to say. If you send me your email address and I hit a 1,000 on my YouTube channel, you could possibly be the one to get the celebration package of five signs. Does that sound good? Did I do that okay? I think that's why I'm going to have to say it. Oh, thank you. Look at you guys. Just as long as there isn't a, a nasty face. We don't like nasty faces. We do our best up here. All right. So this one's going out the door. This one we added the stars and the balls to. See how this wreath has this in it? This one came from the same place and that wasn't in there. There's just like extra in there that's not in that one. Both different and using both signs. Both angel signs that say angel crossing. This one has green with stars. This one has little hearts. They both have the berries. Oh, thank you. <clears throat> well, I'm so glad you could come and keep me company. We had a few laughs. It was fun. I hope I entertained you. Thank you, Jeanette. Jeanette, are you in Lori's group? You got the, the words and phrases, right? I even love this, too. I loved it on this one. And I used that going down the sides and right here and here and here and in the bow. <clears throat> Do you? Aw. Watch me post this and watch her say she's going to change her mind. She wants this one instead. That would be my luck. <laughs> it doesn't matter. I like both of them. So either one is fine. I added tinsel ties to my Etsy boutique. I think I got that right. I added ribbon to my Bet Etsy boutique. I've added more signs to my Etsy boutique and the 1000 celebration to 1000 subscribers to my YouTube channel the winner uh oh is winner allowed will get chosen and be able to pick five signs out of my Etsy boutique bye Susan thank you So, there we go. Another one down. I know, Z. <laughs> I love the bells in this one. I love the colors in this one. I love them both. Just a different take. On the same angel with a different border and um, different coloring. I added green to this border. You too, Missy. Thank you, hon. Love you too. Um, I added green to the other border because I wanted to be able to use different colors with that one. So I like that. It 
doesn't hurt my feelings. Nothing will today. So, all right. Thank you for joining me. Look for me next Tuesday night. Um, I will go on at 6 on Tag Team Tuesday and Willie goes on at 7. So, if you have any questions, um, all the signs are in my Etsy boutique. So, go in and check them out. And I will see you next Tuesday. Alright, have a good evening. Good night.